Kennedy. Seth Troxler, Amsterdam dance event. Welcome, Seth. 2011, it's happening. Yeah. In, real, in real time, on your internets. So Seth, you're quite the uh, media mogul. You've been giving interviews. You've actually been interviewing the interviewees. I, I, yeah, you know, I like to keep the attention off me. You know, because I mean, everyone's got a little something to talk about. Why, why is AD important to you? Well, AD is important to me because you're here. Oh, wow. Wow. Yep. And Ali's here. Do you want to be all so the guys? Because artists are here that the media can interact with. So if you're an artist and you want to interact with media, why not come to ADE? For right your there. viewing pleasure. For your viewing pleasure <laughs> in real time. So you went to the cook-off today. How was that? I went to the cook-off and I won. Really? OK. <laughs> Congratulations. I didn't just go to the cook-off. I came in without the idea in my mind that I was going to lose. I walked in there. I was like, I'm going to fucking win today. What I, did you cook? I made uh, barbecued ribs, uh, like short, like spare ribs, with uh, sweet potato mash and uh, blackened uh, Brussels sprouts. Tell me. With soy sauce. Be honest. And I, have, and I have a secret family barbecue sauce that I made overnight. Be honest. Shipped it in. You did? No. So you practiced? Oh, no, no. I, I brought my own sauce. Okay. I cooked the sauce overnight. Okay. But I have made ribs a lot of times, and I do want to be a professional barbecue cook. So I did have that on my side, the fact that I do actually want to quit DJing to become a cook, even though I'm a pretty professional DJ. <laughs> my passion lies in cooking. So that was uh, kind of on my side. So we're thinking Seth Johnson, no more next year, professional no, maybe chef. maybe like another six, seven years. So you guys got you guys about six, six more years with me and then bam. Okay. I'm going to have some babies and I'm out of here. <laughs> Come catch me at my restaurant. So let's talk about food. the music stuff. Tell us about what you've been up to the last year, what you've got coming oh, up. Oh, well, uh, the last year, I mean, I uh, run this record label, Vision Quest. We've just really been trying to put together a great group of artists to release a lot of, like, music outside of just, like, dance music, but to release um, music again, you know? Like, mm. if people thought about that, you know, there's a couple bands. And, uh, yeah, just been working on that, making releases that are based around aesthetic and art, you know, rather than just putting out products. We've got our group Vision Quest, so we've been doing some uh, music, about to make the remix for David Lynch's uh, new album on Sunday's Best. So yeah, just hanging out. I don't want to be too boring. Uh, I'm a resident at DC10. Summer in Ibiza was pretty yeah. cool. We got crazy. Shit got crazy. Sometimes it got too crazy. I can't believe I'm alive. Are you really here? I don't know. You so know? no DC10 next year? No, no, definitely DC10 next year. Every year, every okay, year, cool. DC10. Okay. No, 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 but I'm just trying to make this as fun and, uh, and entertaining for our, our viewers. Massive. In, uh, on the viewing massive. Viewing uh, massive on the internet. Yeah. On the interwebs. Okay, Seth. How are you guys doing? Thanks for talking to us. Yeah, cool. It's been a pleasure. Seth, pleasure um, to meet you. You're playing at a party sometime this week? I, pl I play at Trow on Sunday okay. and then uh, um, Circle Loco party uh, tomorrow. Brilliant. So we'll see you down at the Circle Loco. I'll, I'll catch you guys there. ADE, holler at your boy. They would say that on Pop TV.